Image communities are free to join and instantly map the photographs that you place in your account to a map. Flickr is an example. Google has one and there are many others. Although you need to be careful with their terms of use because some of these are not appropriate or allowed to be used for business purposes. For instance, I wanted to map a portfolio of a client of mine's to Flickr uh, because they create plans for the built environment and I thought that it might be appropriate to put the plans uh, on the map in a community environment. However, the terms of use are pretty strict for Flickr and I'm not allowed to do that for a business. I can also map my photographs in Google Earth which is interesting because I can turn on multiple layers in Google Earth to see multiple sources of photographs from different places simultaneously, creating a sense of place from a collaborative group of people. Most of the community image galleries also enable you to view your photographs in a gallery and on a map simultaneously. The Newberry Library website, chicagoancestors.org, is an example of bringing in a lot of different types of information into one viewing environment at one scale, and then superimposing it on top of Google Maps. This is called a mashup. It's a very easy to use, user-friendly environment for the public to view lots of different types of data at the same time. In order to create a mashup of your own, you have to hire a web developer who will import the content for you and create web code uh, to link your website to Google Maps and your data on your server to Google Maps in one viewing environment. Because this is extremely complex and can be very expensive, and with the way the economy and the budget cuts are going, I created Neighborhood Maps, which is a Google Maps mashup tool that's available at a very reasonable price that enables you to easily fill out a form, put the photograph, the address, notes, uh, links to other places uh, into the database, and then map it on your website. This slide is a blow-up of the previous slide. It's showing you what it looks like when a photograph and is geotagged onto Google Maps and the mashup tool. You also have the capability to organize the order of the photographs as they appear. They don't necessarily have to appear on the map in the order you enter them into the system or by address.